fight, the fight You did it in a fight last time Motherfucker, you're addicted to your life You gotta fight Coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight division collision Well, just by nature of Conor McGregor returning to the UFC, tonight is one of the biggest nights in the history of the Ultimate Fighting Championship. Conor McGregor making his return after more than 600 days away. Of course, he dipped his toe into the boxing ring against Floyd Mayweather, but ultimately this is a mixed martial artist, and he is out to prove that he can return to the game the way he left it as the best fighter in the world. Conor McGregor has that it factor, along with a fantastic and creative striking game, a very good ground game, and extreme confidence in himself. All these make for a fan-favorite combination. maybe more than we should, but this guy fits the bill. Maybe doesn't stand out in any one area on film, but plus skills everywhere. And you gotta think tonight, Joe, with his skill set, he's more than comfortable really anywhere this fight goes. If he needs to stand and strike, he can do it. If the fight hits the canvas, he can submit you. A lot of different skills brought to the table by this young man. This guy has some of the best defense I've ever seen inside the octagon, and they say that defense is the best offense. Or till the date for this, our main event of the evening. Four years apart, with similar height and reach. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC Heavyweight Division. This is the first fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, only a professional record now. 21 wins, four losses. He stands 5 feet 9 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting at Dublin Island, the notorious Connor McGregor! And now we can see his opponent fighting at the red corner. This man is a Muay Thai kickboxer and jiu-jitsu fighter, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, USA, Van Van. All right, drink the rules in the locker room. You want your demo commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. You want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners. This is off. a fight that we have been looking forward to for a long time and is about to take place right now. I'm very excited. Are uh, you ready? You ready? Let's Here go. we go. And how about the buzz in this arena and just the sheer volume from these fans as Conor McGregor makes his return here tonight. Now, how... Oh! Oh, he might be out. This could be it right here. This guy's throwing early. Combinations. Oh! What a leg kick! Damaging strike there. 
Just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Watch the shot here, Joe. Looking to land the right hand, he misses. Conor McGregor gets caught by that straight punch. You gotta do better than that defensively. Oh, powerful right leg kick. Oh, slips to avoid the right. McGregor gets stung by that leg kick. And there's a nice jab. Just missed with the left there. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. These guys are swinging. Now to go in the round. And there comes the separation now. Stung him with the left there, Joe. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do. Great oh, oh, for the end of round one. All right, so there's the horn. The round is over, but not after serious damage was done. Great round there from Conor McGregor. Yeah, that was a big moment in that round and probably the most significant aspect of the round. Let's take a look at that again. And let's look at it from a different angle. Brittany Palmer with us tonight. Okay, ready? Now two. You ready? All right, let's get to round two. He's definitely going to want to start this round off fast to try to pick up where he left off. His opponent was in big trouble at the end of that round. Oh! oh! Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. Beautiful body, body shot. shot there, too. It appears that cut is getting worse. Wow. He can't, he's very loud. shot to end the fight here. Outstanding knockout. Yeah, Joe, just the way he drew it up as he gets the knockout victory here tonight, it's hard to land a strike more flush than he did right there, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, so he'll see the replay and probably shake his head, but ultimately this is a huge result and a huge win for that fighter here tonight. Here's a different angle on it. And here we see it one more time. Look at the timing in this shot. Boom. And there he is after the huge knockout turned in tonight. Near perfect execution and one of the bigger highlights of his UFC career. All right, let's get it inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer for the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at one minute 
eight seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, the notorious Conor McGregor. Well, doubt this man at your own peril. The